Handicapper Steve here, handicapping the racing from Kentucky Downs here on Thursday. It is the 1st of September, 2022. Going to look at the ninth race from Kentucky Downs, but before I get on to that, remember to please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kit 5 for more selections for race courses around the world. Let's look at the featured ninth race from Kentucky Downs, which is the Tappet Stakes. It's going for a purse of $400,000. Races for three year olds, which have not won a sweepstakes in 2022. We have a field of 15 horses entered. But keep in mind that the course could only uh, handle 12 horses. So 12 horses could go to the, the uniquely style turf course, the distance of ground of a mile and 70 yards. One mile, 70 yards here in the Tappet Sticks. All turf. Remember that. And uh, you need to have good position, I think, at times. Uh, top selection. I'm going to go with the five horse Atone. Let's go 5163 in the Super Facta. 5163 Super. Top selection of five horse Atone. Five year old gelding by Into the Mischief. Mike Maker trains. Tyler Gaffleo and gets them out. The horse's most recent outing came the 4th of August at Saratoga. One mile inner turf course, an optional 80 claimer. And the horse finished third by a head that day. You know, he had a little bit of a wide poster. It was wide throughout. He moved a little bit late, but it wasn't, you know, he needed something more coming here where I think from a good tracking position you should get a good trip with some class relief I think he's sitting on a good race two back around the Forbidden Apple at Saratoga one mile opening day the 15th of July a very tough race could have been a group uh, grade two grade one race um he fit a second by two and three quarter lengths he sat mid-pack most race he moved a little bit late but again he still needed something and then before that in the um Dinner party at Pimlico, mile 16th on the 21st of May. He finished third by one and a half lengths that day. You know, he was setting the fractions, maybe a little bit too ha uh, past to that half mile. Uh, you know, set piece got to him. Set piece was much the best on paper. And then, you know, I, I thought his first, um, his, his his final race of 2021 and his first race of 2022 wasn't half bad. Final race of 2021 was in the mile and eighth Fort Lauderdale at Goldstream, where he finished second by one and a half lengths, really closing up from nowhere. Came back to run in the Pegasus World Cup turf, where he finished fourth. Again, closing up from nowhere. I thought it was a decent race there, and then came back to run a decent fourth in the um, in the Maker's Mark Mile. He's making his local debut. I think he can handle the course. I'm going to use him. It wouldn't surprise me if Ramsey Solution, the one horse, steals it on the front end. Um, most recently at Goldstream, going mile 16th on the Tapita and a handicap. He won by four and a half lengths, and he closed up from mid pack. Even after not beginnings and a little bit of a wide trip, he won quite nicely. Before that, you know, his races in 2021, he only started once uh twice but he always ran these good places there uh and then he ran here in 2020 in the uh tap of stakes which, which he actually won by length from a tracking position that's when the course was very speed favoring he has a lot of speed and twin it wouldn't surprise me if he s steals it on the front end at eight to one i'll definitely use him in the late pick four but to recap my selection for the ninth from kentucky downs it is the tap at stakes let's take the five horse of tone give kudos to the one horse ramsey solution 5163 Super, 5 1 in your multi race. So, good luck to one. Please follow me on Twitter at Horse Racing Kid 5. Good luck, everybody.